Hey guys, so we've got another parcel today. Two reviews in a day, that's a record for me. And this time it is from China. So I think I know what this is as well. It is called the Nano Pack 2.0 and also the Nano Pack. If I'm not mistaken, I only purchased the Nano Pack 2.0 because I do not need the Nano Pack. I think you can see it, it says Nano Pack 2.0. So they had obviously the first version and they improved upon that. Immediately I can see some, you know, stitching coming out. I hope it doesn't affect the performance. So I got it in three different colors. And it's basically an ultra light, ultra strong, and ultra portable shopping bag or whatever bag you want to make it. Let's open the blue one. So before I take it off, just compare it to the size of my palm. It's pretty small, it can fit in your pocket, definitely can be thrown into your bag. Okay, so when you take it off, the bag actually is attached to the... The carrier bag is actually attached to the bag, so you won't lose it. It is very lightweight. And wow, that's pretty big. And I'm definitely going to have a lot of trouble putting this bag in its pouch. I guess you can hold it down here or most likely most comfortable is to hang it around. And let's find some heavy things to put inside here. I've got a new sealed optimum nutrition whey protein. Let's put it in. Right, not a problem. Can we put two? I've got another one. Don't judge me. It was on discount, so I have a lot of it. I mean the protein, I have a lot of them in stock right now. That's not bad. Since the strap is pretty wide, it's not a really thin strap, it's pretty comfortable to be placed on your, on your shoulder. Alright, so just reading some of the key features from the website. So obviously it's portable. The fabric measures at only 0.002 inches. It's strong, it can carry up to 25 kilogram or 55 pounds. Soft, yep, it is extremely soft. It has a reinforced ripstop nylon polymer fabric. So I guess that just goes back to the point that it's strong. It's water resistant, so when you put it on the floor or I don't know, you can use it as a last resort to run in the rain. Packs into the small pouch, yep. So this thing fits 18 liters and it only weighs 22 grams. I'm not sure if this is applicable to all of my bags, but the finishing on this blue bag is not that great. You've got a lot of loose stitching. I'm not sure if that's going to impact the performance or the durability. I hope not because I really like this. And the Nano Pack, the one that I did not get, is basically the same fabric and it's one of those drawstring bags and it's also a portable and it fits into a pouch but obviously it's going to be a bit bigger than this. So yeah, that's pretty much it. There's not much you can say about this. It's, as advertised, it's a small bag that is also strong. But the challenge now is, can I get it back into this small pouch. If you guys are interested, they are still on Indiegogo where I crowdfunded this project. And they go for 11 USD at the moment for each the Nano Bag 2.0 or the Nano Bag. It's both priced the same. One second, I just need to concentrate a little bit more for this. <laughs> Getting a bit sloppy towards the end but Oh, the back is coming off a bit. Hey, that's not bad. Especially for a first attempt. Would I recommend this? 100%. This is going to be a life saviour for a lot of people. You can use it for a lot of things. You know, since it's waterproof, let's say you want to sit on the floor and it's wet, you just put this on the floor and this thing will protect your butt. Is it worth $11 each? Maybe, maybe not but I really like it. Okay, so that's all for this video. 
I would really recommend this if you don't already have a small bag that you keep in your bigger bags. See you guys next time.